it. No, you, you're crazy. You're crazy, Ted. You're crazy. Now listen, I'm not the one that's crazy. You're the one that's crazy. Talk show giant Horace Legrand's epic meltdown is meltdown. all over the news. Just look at what's going on right now with this whole election. You've got two candidates. One on one side is making a complete mockery and circus of what the election is supposed to be, and the other one is showing that she'll do anything she can just to get a black vote. Oh whether God. it's now saying she's got crazy. hot sauce in her bag or showing that she can do the whip and the damn nay nay. What is that gonna do about the real issues at hand? How is that gonna change the fact that police are out here killing black men and women? Which one of these candidates is gonna change the fact that so many black names now appear on social media with oh the hashtag? in front of it. Philando Castile, Alton B. Sterling, Trayvon Martin, Sandra Bland, Jonathan Farrell. The list goes on and on and nothing's being done about it. Now you know they're going to try and make it seem like you're crazy. It always feels good when you told the truth. That's what you did, man. You woke the world up. Yeah, but now everybody thinks I'm crazy as hell. I said, I don't want to talk about it. You act like I wasn't the one sitting next to you while you have a meltdown. Meltdown? Come on, baby. You are the key. You can never, ever let them feel like they're doing you a favor. Shit, that's how you keep them in power. His latest rant has put us in a situation where we have no choice but to take action. If you know the truth and you don't say it, then you're no different than the devil that planted the lie in the first place. Now wake up. Seeing that psychiatrist is not going to change anything. All they want to do is make it like I'm crazy. Day, I am so sick of it, Ori. Say this and say that. What happened to us? You're not crazy.